CNN host Joan Walsh says Trump is sexist for suggesting Melania could make salads. On Monday night, a CNN panel went after President Donald Trump for remarks he made to the championship-winning Clemson Tigers during their visit to the White House. At a ceremony commemorating their visit, President Trump informed the team about the meal choices he contemplated amid the partial government shutdown. Do we have no food for you because we have the shutdown? Trump asked. Or do we give you some quick salads that the first lady will make, along with, along with the second lady, they'll make some salads. And I said you guys aren't into salads. Or do I go out, Lindsey Graham and Tim Scott, do I go out and send out for about 1,000 hamburgers, Big Macs? So we actually did that. CNN commentator Joan Walsh called those comments appalling. It seems to me like the president will not be happy until there is not one single female Republican voter in the country, Walsh said. It's incredibly sexist. Walsh told CNN anchor Aaron Burnett that since First Lady Ivanka Trump often serves as a senior advisor to the president that his remarks demean her. We aren't all here to make salads for men. It's disgusting. Walsh added. Burnett appeared to agree. Sometimes what people say when they're being funny exposes exactly who they are and what they think. Not that there was any question, but this is pretty clear, Burnett said. Conservative commentator Scott Jennings told the panel that he didn't interpret Trump's remarks as sexist. That didn't sit well with the CNN anchor. How in the world can you not perceive that as sexist? to make the assumption that his wife will go make salads for a bunch of football players? What is she, like, the cook? Burnett pushed back. Jennings responded by telling Burnett that she may be overreading Trump's comments. I'm not overreading it. He made a joke that was sexist about women, Burnett told Jennings. I guess maybe what we're disagreeing with is whether it's funny and whether humor is something that serious. Before ending the segment, Burnett told viewers, I have to say, I'm open about when I have an opinion. I feel pretty strongly.